Hey everyone, so in this video I'm going to go over mnemonics and hints to remember lab values. So first we're going to discuss some electrolytes. So the first one is calcium. So a hint to remember calcium is cool 911 because calcium is very important so you're going to call 911. So the range is 9 to 1, 1, 11. 9 to 11. So the next one to remember is potassium. One of the most potassium rich foods is bananas. So when you have a bunch of bananas, it usually comes with three to five bananas and you want them to be half ripe. So the range is going to be 3.5 is the half, so 3.5 to 5. And the next one you should remember is phosphorus. So if you look at the end of the word, it says for us, like phosphorus. So for is four and us is like me and you, so two. So the range is 2.5 to 4.5. So you just add on a 0.5 for both. So 2.5 to 4.5. So now we're going to discuss some of the lab values for the metabolic panel. So the first one we have is BUN, so bun. So when a normal, a normal price for a hamburger bun in the store is going to be somewhere between 7 to 20. So 10 to 20, 7 to 20. So that's going to be your range for BUN. And then what goes along with BUN a lot of times is creatinine. So you're going to see the BUN is going to be the upper lace, the uppercase levels, and the creatinine is the lowercase, and a lot of little ones. So you're going to think of a little number. 0.5 to 1.1 is the woman. And for the men, it's just 0.1 on top, so it's 0.6 to 1.2. Then goes the hemoglobin. So that's also going to be different for girls and boys. So girls, you're going to think of that they mature before boys. So they mature between the ages of 12 to 16. And a boy's body matures between the ages of 14 to 18. So two years up from that. And the next one is a hematocrit. So that's pretty easy because that's just three times the hemoglobin. So whatever your hemoglobin is, it's just three times that. Then the next one is the hemoglobin A1C, which has the, the number 1 in it. So think of the numbers. So you're going to think of 3, 4, 5, 6. So the 3 is because the hemoglobin A1C is the average, the average of glucose from 3 months. And the 4, 5, 6 is what you want to get between 4 and 6. And the next one is the glucose level. So glucose, think of glue. Who plays with glue? Kids. Kids between 6 to 12 years old. So you're going to think of 60 to 120. 6 to 12, just add in a 0. 60 to 120. And those are the ends of the mnemonics and hints I have for the lab values. Good luck studying.